Hey guys, Sorka, welcome back to Deltarune. Let's carry on where we left off. Susie has just completed Operation Rescue Noelle, which means she is safely in the hands of Birdly. Or you could say Birdly is actually in the hands of Noelle, getting his neck throttled for daring to have a crush on Susie, as all of a sudden Wear Wear Wire strongly blocks the way and interrupts my monologue, which I am not very appreciative of, but I suppose we can take care of business here. I guess you're going to be an upgraded version of Weirwire, which means you may take a bit longer to subdue, and your attacks might be a little bit better. So, I suppose, let's start off with a check. Let's see what your difference is to the others. It absorbed the wire and became stronger. Be careful. Alright, everyone, on guard! It became the wire. Whoa! That's a lot of tension. <laughs> I've already maxed out my tension points. As it shuffles coolly. <laughs> okay. Uh, wow. I just heard a lot of tension point gathering and kind of got me excited, if I may say so myself. Let's, um... Let's start by being tough. Because being sweet can come later. Susie can play bad cop for now. Rousey defend. You and Susie told where we're wired you'd beat them up for a cool 16%. The air crackles with fighting spirit. Okay. And then I suppose we can see what happens if we be sweet. Whoa. Whoa. Ah, damn. Caught me at the last second. Classic. Crackles are level too high for you to understand. Are you serious? I thought we are pretty young, right? We should be able to comprehend these high frequency levels. Uh, alright, let's try being sweet now. Susie, defend, please. 5%? You and Ralsei whispered sweetly to where we are. Goes to show, man. Being nice sometimes just doesn't pay. I pretended not to care, but acts became more effective. I take that back. Being nice can have benefits later down the line. It's called karma. <laughs> okay, so let's see what the difference is as we start dodging like crazy. Alright, um, looks strong just standing there. 21%. Let's be tough and Ralph say you should be able to <laughs> use a heal prayer because we're maxed out on tension points since the very first round. 32%. Okay, doubled. I like that. You and Susie told where we're wired you'd beat them up. The air crackles with fighting spirit. Okay, 85%. All it takes is one more B tough and we can spare. Let's go ahead and do that. You and Susie told where we are, you'd beat them up again. You won! $350. Excellent. Okay, so we can go to the third floor. We got a room here. Or we've got a strange cutout here. This is very suspicious. Is there anything here? No? Interesting. Okay. <laughs> or we can keep going. Um, well, hang on. Let's just have a quick look. Though I uh, have regretted progressing in the past like this. Whoa. Alright. Um, let's go back. Alright, change of plans. Let's go to the third floor and see where that leads and decide where we want to go from there. Wait. We were on the fourth floor? We went downstairs? We've gone backwards! Oh god. I am so disoriented right now. Hang on. Where does this go? Whoa. Damn. Uh, this is not what I was expecting to see going into this room. The statue of Birdly is wedged in the toilet. You glance back at the bathroom door sign. The sign has a silhouette of a Birdly statue. Everything checks out. <laughs> okay. Does it though? I suppose if he's shoving his head in the toilet, that must mean he's a literal dickhead. <laughs> Considering his crotch is up there. Oh, hello. Uh, it's occupied actually, I think. When are they going to be done in there? Uh, no clue. I don't even know if he can get out, to be honest. It's an inanimate object, after all, stuck in the toilet. Uh, wow. That was not what I was expecting to see. Now I'm even more disoriented. Hang on, let's check out what's over here. Oh yeah, that's, that's, that's those guys watching that Dark Fountain video. And we got teacups. Okay. Um, actually, you know what? This is good. This is good. That means we can go to the first floor. We can go and, uh, learn a bit more about Spamton and his desire to become a big shot, because I think you guys mentioned in the comments, we can come here to the cafe, and I think we can go to the trash zone as well. If we want to learn more about him. So let's see what this guy has to say. Basement robot. Good start. So that's what happened. That robot was the embodiment of a light nurse dream. A dream I helped create. Once. Splashing color from the motion of their hand. The Lightner filled it with their own hope, giving it an incredible power. But, in the end, nothing ever came of it. 
and it was left in the basement with the rest of the corrupted data. Oh, great. So he was discarded and basically he fueled his desire for revenge. Perfect. But that crooked salesman, somehow he learned about the robot and thought he could use its power to fulfill his own twisted dreams. Ah, uh, right. Okay, so I think we had hints that Spantan was comprised of like two entities of sorts. Whenever he wasn't talking in his uh, garbled gibberish, there was, you know, some sort of coherent thought we could tell by the proper um, syntax and grammar in the text boxes. So he was possessed by a spirit. Is that it? What a pity to think he was once a valued customer. Right, of course. That's what you care about. <laughs> the fact that you lost a loyal customer. Perfect. All right. Um, let's go ahead and go back to the trash zone. Okay, let's uh, let's start by going to his his store. I suppose it's a good place, any. Oh, hello, guys. I don't recall you guys being here before. He was like the rest of us, just a little unlucky. For some reason, his products never seemed to hit, and the lightners never even looked his way. Poor guy. Ah, all right. So he started off as a down on his luck salesman, and he evolved from there. <laughs> Night after night, when we all went to the same cyber grill. He'd shoot his mouth about making it big someday. You just watch. Someday, I'm going to be a big shot. Oh, dear. And he ended up being taken out by a big shot. He started to get a little desperate. I already started looking for any way to become more popular. Somehow he made the right phone call and found someone. Or was he found by someone? They must have been helping him, because suddenly... He was on the phone all the time. Really? Suddenly, he got really good at his job. The clicks started piling up. What? What did he do? Why did he deserve this? We were all so jealous of him. We stopped going out with him. Oh, great. I mean, wasn't he a big shot? He didn't need us anymore, did he? Sheesh. Just because he climbed up to the top doesn't mean that you guys have to ignore him now. There's nothing I hate more than people who are jealous, like f friends of yours, that suddenly become jealous of your success and don't want to associate with you anymore. I find that kind of weak, <laughs> to be perfectly honest. Like, don't you want to support your friends that, as they become more successful? I, I understand some people don't want to associate with that because they're like, oh man, he, he did it, I can't do it, and that just makes me upset at my own shortcomings or something. I, I mean, yeah, it's fair if they become successful and they become a douche about it for some reason, or they tr become preachy, like, oh, if I can do it, you can do it too, and then they just constantly hound you, then yeah, sure, but, you know, <laughs> don't assume that he doesn't need you anymore because he became a big shot. He even so, he only got more and more successful. He moved into a luxurious room in the Queen's Mansion. He started bragging about big TV deals, big cars, big commercials. Okay, yeah, so this is understandable. At least if I'd heard this first, then I'd be like, okay, that's fine. But then things started to crack. It seems like whatever was helping him disappeared. His sales dropped to zero, and everything came crashing down. Zero, like, it didn't just start dipping. It literally plummeted to zero. Wow, okay. Certainly seems like he got some assistance there, and it was promptly withdrawn. Hmm. The day he was to be evicted from the Queen's Mansion, I went to his room to check on him. But he wasn't there. There was only a phone hanging up the handle. He must have left in the middle of a conversation, because I could still hear someone on the other end. You sure he didn't, like, leave the Matrix or something? But when I put the receiver to my ear, there was nothing but garbage noise. Ooh. Well, I don't know why, that just gave me a chill. <laughs> kind of creepy. Uh, okay. Is that all we got? His, uh, his store is still empty? Though we do get that brief soundbite of him, like, trying to speak. Hmm. Alright, well, uh, thanks for the information, lads. Take care. You know, you don't have to hang out in the trash zone. It, uh, undervalues your products, I think. Especially because no one seems to be passing through here. You have anything new to say, my friend? Some funny looking guys have gathered to the west. They were muttering something about muttering something about deals. Oh, oh yeah, sorry, I've already spoken to them. Thanks, though. Should have uh, spoken to you first. Alright, back to the fourth floor. I suppose we can check out what's in this room. Oh. It's a bedroom of sorts. Wait, is this the same bedroom where Noelle was? Yes, it is. There's that softball moon in the background. 
Okay, well, let's let's take a look around. Whoa, this statue rocks. Hey, Rousey, can we take this from my room? Huh? Um, th that, that would be stealing. You stole the Susie-like statue. Well, there we go. I don't know how it fit in our pocket, but I'm certainly not going to dump it in the toilet. <laughs> there are all sorts of clothes inside. Huh? Never seen Noelle wear anything like this. What is it? Is that her, um, priestess outfit? There are catalogs of search results. Seems like most things couldn't be made into objects. Hmm. From the search, is Ice E real cryptid? What do we have here anyway? Is it an icy cushion? A plushie? A beanbag? It's a cross between Ice E and something else. Hey, Chris, take this for your room. Uh, okay. <laughs> it's not even like a request. Like, do you want to take this for your room? It's just, Chris, take this for your room, damn it. Um, th that would be stealing, too, you know, like, guys, we're lightners, we're supposed to be good people, we don't steal things. You stole the IC statue for some reason. <laughs> Sorry, Rousey. Your words mean nothing here. It's a calendar. Every page is the last month, every day is the 25th. Christmas Day, every day? Wow, my wife would be super stoked about that. <laughs> she really wants to pick up the, put up the Christmas tree. It's not already, it's only halfway through November. Terrible. It's a bed, go to sleep. Uh, no. We don't have time to sleep. It's not your bed anyhow. Okay. You know what? Fine. In that case, I'm going to steal the use of this bed. C Chris, what if Noelle came in here? Well, then she can wake me up and we can switch places. Yeah, what if she has ticks? Get out of there! Sorry. Okay, uh, glad I explored those two areas. Now we can proceed without feeling guilty. I probably shouldn't have rushed into this. Whoa. Okay, ah! Should have taken some time to think about this. Just rushing through. <laughs> okay. Looks like we escaped the worst of it. Whoa. It's quite the uh, quite the rug there. Well, it's not even really a rug. It's just the design of the carpet. There she is. Oh, looks like we got the uh, dark fountain in the background. This must be the boss fight. Definitely glad I explored those other rooms in. Queen! Stop right there! Ah, oh, my sweet idiot children. Hello. You are just in time to witness my world domination. Even though I technically already ruled this world. I suppose I'm talking about the real world now. With Noelle in my possession, it is only a matter of time before her will turns. And she unleashes her power. What's her power? What's so special about Noelle? No offense, Susie. I'm just asking why Queen needs her so bad. Blanketing the world in... Too late, dumbass. Noelle's with Birdly. We don't know if Burnley's still alive, but she's with him. Oh. Then who this? Oh my god. B Burnley? But he's been... He's been wired. No! Intercepted. <laughs> my control plugs are now suitable for teenagers. I tried plugging it into a statue as a sort of test. Turns out the statue wasn't perfectly representative of him. Now the whole family can enjoy eternal servitude. Sort of regal, mostly cruel laughter. Ho, 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 ho. Wait, then. Where's Noelle? That's probably a question I should ask straight away. Yeah, where is Noelle? What happened? Did she, like, turn him in or something? Like, you son of a bitch, Burnley! And then just tossed him Queen's way? Or or what? Did she, like, bargain? Laughter becomes more cruel. Ho, 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 ho. Oh, I wonder. I actually know the answer. Enough already! Oh, dear. I do sincerely quite like you two. It will be a shame to force you to serve me. An enjoyable shame. <laughs> Alright, this is it. The boss fight. Queen blocks the way. Everyone's blocking the way. Unfortunately, we uh, took a few wounds on the approach to what I can guess is the throne room. Uh, well, let's start. Queen, defenseless. And Birdley's here too. We can loosen, group loosen, or throw. Uh, okay. Well, group loosen requires all three of us, so let's try that. 15%, everyone loosens Birdly! Queen, think of the Lightners. Aren't we supposed to make them happy? Is that not what I am doing? Is it? Is it what you're doing? Whoa. Ah! Birdly! Stop! We, we're friends now! We made an alliance, remember? The fountain flows ominously. Uh, okay, so we haven't done any mercy on Queen yet. I suppose we need to dislodge Birdly first. 
Group loosen again. Everyone loosens birdly. Think. Lightness have already been enslaved by me and my kin. Your kin? Whoa. Uh-oh. Ah! She's threatening to drown us! In what I can only presume is acid. Damn. I started falling in that, uh... In that wine glass. Queen's acid shield is formed. Okay. Queen is now protected. Birdly is on his way to being loosened. Okay, we've got different options now. Toast, group toast, dual heal, and re red buster. Unfortunately, we don't have all tension points. Let's do a group toast. We don't need to heal ourselves just yet. That glass of acid is generating her shield. So, uh, you gonna drink all that? No, this is all mine. You can't have it. Queen slips from her acid. Okay, and that's reducing her shield, I'm guessing. Each day they spend hours worshipping in glowing rapture. Our screens of funny animals and candied games. Ah! She's trying to step on me! No! This is not what I asked for, Queen! You're not the kind of person I want stepping on me. Thank you. With those, uh, goddess-like legs. <laughs> uh, alright. Let's do another group toast. She sips from her acid. That's her entire, uh, shield gone. Staring, tapping to receive joy. Staring, tapping to avoid pain. Uh, are we really avoiding pain by, you know, doom scrolling and all that sort? <laughs> I can't say we are. Oh. Damn. Loading screen is now an attack. I don't like it. Okay, that wasn't so bad. Uh, all right, well, let's see what, what we can do with throw and we can get Rousey. Oh, wait. No, we don't have enough to heal ourselves yet. Let's just do another group loosen, and let's start gathering some tension points. If only we were facing off against, uh, Wearer Wire again, then we could max out straight away. Until recently, when the town's internet disappeared. Now the refuge they take in the screens will slowly fade. Right, so what are you planning? Okay, there we go. That's... some good tension point generation. The battlefield feels electric, so are you trying to get people off their devices? For what reason? So you can ambush us? because we're not paying attention anymore. Uh, okay, now it's time to throw. And let's do a heal prayer on yourself, or I'll say. Or, uh, actually, dual heal, heals everyone. Let's, let's save up for that, I think. It's probably a better idea, rather than just healing one person. Everyone loosens Birdly. Noel, then who will help her? Her strange and sad searches. Who will answer them? Not you. I've seen the answers you've come up with. They're terrible. They're not. They're not even accurate. Ah. Sorry. Need tension points. Thank you. Okay. Fifty-six percent. Uh. Let's do a dual heal. And Susie, do a toast, please. Your soul shine its power on Ralse. Susie made a toast to Queen. Pretty cool how we're, uh, gonna kick your ass. It's a good thing I have no standards for this. Wow, one sip. And everyone's fully healed. I like it. Okay. Is what I wondered until the night appeared and created this wonderful world of darkness. The night. Who is the night? Whoa! Ah! Okay. Not bad, not bad. Dodged it all. Group toast. Everyone toasted to Queen. Queen sips from her acid. This is gonna take some time. Now the path is clear. All I have to do is expand this dark world. Ah. Gosh, she's got quite the variety of attacks, huh? Okay, damn. Thought we could dodge all of it. Another group toast, please. Everyone toasted to Queen. Almost there. Then with the world covered in darkness, no one will have to suffer anymore because you won't know what happiness is, so technically it's all fair. I see. Oh god, she's trying to step on us as well. Okay, this isn't so bad. <laughs> she was focusing on the wrong area. It smells like overclocked high heels, oh dear. There we go. Instead, everyone can live in my perfect mansion, every day blissfully worshipping me like we both deserve. Both? Is it Noel as well? Trauma! Ah! 
Damn. Our attacks evolved. Queen's Acid Shield is down. Um... Quite curious about throw. Let's let's experiment here. Let's see what happens when we do a throw. And we can defend, actually, and get some more attention points out of it. Oh, okay. So it's just like the regular one. Uh, let's time this right. Let's see if we get all four. Nice. The wire was cut. 25%. I think that's more than we get from just doing a regular toast. Now, stop resisting and welcome the new age of darkness. Uh, yeah. Not gonna happen. Thank you. We're not looking for the dark age. Although... The internet seems to be bringing it about <laughs> quite quickly. Queen's Acid Shield is formed again. Uh, let's do a dual heal. Red Buster, red damage. Let's uh, let's have a look and see what this does. Does this damage Queen, or is this gonna break through the barrier? Let's do that, and we'll defend. Get our attention points up. The soul shine its power on Susie. Susie used Red Buster. Ooh, wow. Okay, I like that. Yeah. That's a lot of damage to our shield. We won't let you control everyone with your wires. Well, when did I say I would do that? You guys are supposed to volunteer. Birdly! How? Oh no, I'm almost down. Ah! Damn. I should have gotten hit there, but I did not, so that's good. Um, I can't do a dual heal. I wish I could, like, defend someone else and then do a dual heal. Unfortunately, I have to respect the turn order. So a group toast. Good. Shield's gone. Enough, you foolish children. You may have survived my attacks regularly, but I've been secretly been downloading my ultimate move the whole time. Now perish in the bosom of my hellish reign. Not the queen's bosom. She's downloading the ultimate attack. Can we DDoS her? Download failed. Okay. Oh, no. Ah, shit. Okay, somehow. Did not get hit. I like it. Uh, dual heal, please. And loosen. We're so close. Your soul shined its power on Ralsei. Susie loosens one of Birdly's wires. Okay, we're all healed up, except for me, but uh, close enough. So that final move was supposed to be cooler, but the internet is down. Good. I'm glad. For once, I'm happy the internet is not working. I never thought I'd say that sentence in my life. The battlefield feels electric. Okay, we're so close. Let's just do a group loosen. Everyone loosens Birdly! That's it! Birdly! Not bad, you foolish children. Notice how I've upgraded you from idiot children? What the? What are you doing? Why isn't my control wire working? Thanks to my comrades' kindness. Their mercy! Now, it's time. For me to take my freedom. Queen, you may have mastered the number three, but can you stand up against four of us? Running simulation four, the number four. Is this even possible? Can we all fit on the same screen? Hmm, you are definitely going to kick my ass. I'm going to have to even the odds. 4v2. Noelle, darling, come here. I'm just predicting. At last. Oh no, what that? Oh no, we all fell for it! Damn it, guys! At least one person needs to keep an eye on Queen. Wait! Wait one nanosecond! You... You coward at! You think one nanosecond's gonna make a difference there, Birdly? You! You! Birdly, you're right. Alas. B Birdly? Haha. <laughs> Just now. Was nothing more than simple bravado. The truth is... That wire... Already absorbed all of my succulent energy juices. I'm juiceless. Not useless, mind you. Just juiceless. Oh no. Birdly! Hey! Hey, Birdly! Are you okay? Oh, look at Susie showing compassion. I like it. Everything. Getting. Dark. Only. I knew it. Only a kiss from a beautiful gamer girl can save me now. Mm, I'm ready. I already got my duck lips ready. Birdly? Oh my god. What? Like, get your. Like, losing consciousness and stuff, but. Could you speak up? I didn't quite catch that bot. Um, uh. S sorry, I. Suddenly, I. Uh, I'm feeling a bit better. 
Just you just had to breathe on me, I guess. That was that was good enough. Hey, that's a relief. Maybe he's just happy she cared. Well, uh, gotta hurry and save Noelle, so... Uh, later. I'm not even gonna worry if you're okay or not. Susie, wait for us! Ah, uh, dear Susan. So enigmatic in her ways. But I can read her heart, Chris. Like a health meter. <laughs> and it's beeping. For love. Usually when your heart meter beeps, it's because you're in critical condition. <laughs> <laughs> well, enough tales, Chris. Good luck. May the smarts not be with you. I'd rather they were with me. Okay. Okay, well, thank you, Birdly, for your contribution. Again, I hope you get better soon. You can try infuse yourself with power from the saving star over there. Chris, your deep concern for me is dextrose. But stay sanguine, my fellow bluebird. I'll find some way to help you yet. Look, I'm just blue, all right? I'm not a blue bird. All right, let's go catch up with Susie. I'll say, come on, walk faster. Oh, Susie, there you are. <laughs> Jeez. Walk really fastly. There she is. The night. The roaring night. Today, it deigns to create this world. Reaching its long hand to the sky. I wonder why her voice is different. It coursed its will into its blade, and made, thrusting the fountain from the earth. Unfortunately, the world they created is trapped within the confines of the library. If only we had a way to make more darkness, we might be able to cover the whole world. That is when I realized, this power, this power of the will, this power of determination, Determination exists here, too. I think that's our first reference to it, right? Before, uh, whenever we'd save or whatnot, it was just, um, you're filled with the power of whatever it was around. And whenever we got a game over, it was just, um, it's not supposed to be our fate, right? Is this not something that all Lightners possess? Why isn't Ralsei up here? Why is Noel taking his place? If one was simply determined enough, could not anyone make a dark fountain? So then, if the night has taken its leave, then I will simply make a new one. Make a new night? <gasps> Noel, honey darling, sweetie gravy. <laughs> I couldn't fit any more terms of endearment to the sentence. How do you find the giant hand? Noel? Great, and how do you feel about world domination? One word, TM. Oh. Ooh, Alchimama! <laughs> Su Susie, you, you came to save me. Somehow I, I, I knew you would. Uh, you did? We gave you that idea. It's not like I've got a history of saving you ever. Um, I mean, I, um, well. Wait, 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 wait. You need to get out of here. Hurry! Huh? Oh god. Is she in a mecha of some kind? Whoa. It's Metal Gear Queen! C queen Seems that you failed to notice. The giant freaking robot in the middle of my palace. You were just focused on one section at a time each time you climbed up the floors. Th this isn't good. She's... She's invincible like this. Huh? She... She's been bragging about her final form all day. Huh. 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 You think growing a few inches is gonna help? Just a few inches. Yes. Whoa! Are we cool to take over the world now? S Susie, let's just give up and... Hell if we're giving up now! S Susie? Please, I wanna live, I wanna live with you and have babies. So what if you got another four? We've got one too. Chris, Ralsei, come on. You know, we'll do what we did when we were playing the arcade game. Ralsei, bend over. Chris, stand on him. I'm gonna control your arms. <laughs> oh god, it's actually happening. <laughs> what are you doing? Are you serious right now? We're gonna die. 
This is our ultimate. Uh, w w wait a sec. Now that you mention it. Oh no, it appears I am evenly matched. Oh god, what am I going to do? Please, stop cheating. I hope you won't mind if I don't hold back. Ah! Uh, we're falling! <laughs> Thanks, Ralse. Any bright ideas on how we're getting out of this one? Um, we could try flapping our arms? Fear not. Your knight in the glow-in-the-dark armor is here. Please don't, don't refer to yourself as the knight. Birdly? Whoa. Chris, Susie, my energy is still too low to help you fight. But I have managed to put together the Birdly train. So I found help for you. Behold, comrades. Damn it, Birdly. You're so sexy right now. This is the kind of heroism we expect from you. On your quest against Queen, you made all sorts of buddies, right? You see our jump making skills? We modified everyone to work together. You, you modified people? I shall also take credit for this. Uh, are you supposed to be petrified? There he is. At least he can still speak. What about Lanza? Oh god, the original Star Walker's there too. Chris, Susie, behold! The ultimate group project. Chef's kiss. With a splendid base. I don't want to pilot this. This was in the toilet, damn it! My strongest JPEGs. Flashing lights. Happy bravery. Meow noise. <laughs> My energy. Beep, beep, beep. Tender loving care. Fresh cooking. Organization. Star Walker. <laughs> and most of all, whatever this thingeth is. Oh dear. Whoa. All right. I love it. So glad I recruited all these guys. Uh oh. <laughs> it's 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 one of the amalgamations. <laughs> but less spooky. Finally, a worthy opponent. Round one. Oh, we're gonna fight again. I forgot the controls. Giga Queen blocks the way. Okay, never mind. We're not gonna be fighting like that. We have 250 HP. There is no mercy this time. Okay. We're gonna have to fight. That's fine by me. Well, <laughs> the time for words is over. Now is the time to fight only. I see. Okay, we can still dodge. Too slow. The knight is young for fighting. Uh, I suppose we can only get tension points by defending. We can heal, we can do power attacks, better dodge. Um, we don't need that, we can just do a regular fight. Though it may take some time. We only did 4%. Probably because my timing was off last time. Haha, <laughs> just kidding, I totally will keep on longing as I kick at your face. Whoa, damn. Those legs, they are really fancy. Ah, damn. Can't believe I took one to the face just then. Punch during Queen's turn with uh, X or Circle after she attacks. Okay, I didn't realize I could do that. We should probably do that. Ah, oh, damn, missed. The time has come for Noelle to realize her own strength, her own will, her own determination. Ah. Oh. oh, okay, I can punch those. Oh, we should do that. Whew. The knight is young for fighting. Uh, we can do self-fix, but we don't need to heal 100 HP just yet. 76%, I like it. Progress. Focusing into her blade, she will create a Neodog fountain. Then another, then another. She'll never work for you. How? 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 Okay. The cityscape roars past. Okay, we definitely took some damage there. Suffix engaged. A healing aura fired up, but the TP cost increased. Okay, so we can't just uh, rely, rely on it forever by reaching 20%. Then, when the whole world is covered in darkness, she and everyone can live in bliss, fear, free of fear and suffering. Okay. Right back at you. Nice. Oh, she's, uh, she's not happy. If only, uh... <laughs> you did that rapid pounding on my face. Round two begins. Queen's attacks got tougher. 
Not nice. Chris, Susie, why don't you help me too? Create the world of your dreams, also my dreams. Why don't you ever reference Ralsei, I wonder? Ah. Keep dodging too uh, early. Okay. Ralsei advises you to dodge, then counterpunch. That's uh, not a bad strat. Suffix engaged. TP cost increased. Susie. Bro, just let me karate chop you and you can have many, as many skateboards as you want. Ow. 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 Damn it. Getting my ass whooped out here. Susie bashes the controls trying to punch more. I feel like that's exactly what I'm doing to my detriment. 56%. And Chris, my dearest Trucy, you can have as many. Um. Okay, I don't remember what you liked. I suppose you did. Rip your own soul out, but I didn't know that because you didn't Google it. Right. Too far away for me to punch. The night is young for fighting. Ah. Hey, was there a third guy? Damn. You're really gonna forget Ralsei like that? Alright, not bad, not bad. It's 40%. 45%. Join me and all of you will become super strong and cool. Meanwhile, I don't need to improve because I'm already perfect and shoot, can shoot lasers from my fancy glass. Ah. Ow. I'm getting wrecked out here. Damn it. Uh. Can I heal? Okay, it does work. I can feed my thrash machine a dark burger. Brilliant. Okay, I believe I've made my point. I'm going to procedurally loop my dialogue now. Thank you. Ah, too early again. Ooh, nice combo, nice combo. Uh, self-fix again, please. The time for words is over. Now is the time to fight only. <laughs> it is looping. Oh. Damn it. I'm not making much progress. 37%. Come on. There we are. Round three. Incoming. Haha, <laughs> 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 just kidding. I totally will keep on logging as I kick out your face. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> this is too much. Don't you laugh at me. Round three begins. Queen's attacks get extreme. All right. Well, I'm not taking. I'm not taking uh, a chance. Let's have a light candy this time. The time has come for Noah to realize our own strength. Just dodge, I think, for that part. Thirty-six percent. Finally, a perfect shot. Ah. Okay. Another self-fix is required. 9%. Should we risk it? For the biscuit. Let's try. Damn, I didn't realize you started talking new dialogue there, Queen. You have earned the right to remember what your fighting machine's true purpose is. To get your own ass thrashed. By me. With my final attack. Ha <laughs> ha bye. Okay. Oh dear. Ah. Hold on, here she comes! Ah, oh, right back at you. Sure you can- Oof. Battle power, dropping. Overheat, activated. You punched a ball in my face, it's effectively a tea bag. Listen well, you may have defeated me, but I still possess one thing. You three will never have. Detachable hands! Oh god! Ah! Well, I don't even know what happened there. I can barely interpret that image. Meanwhile, Noelle 
Just praying for our survival. Noel, Darling! Honey? Pumpkin! Sweetie! Sorry. Gravy? Ugh! Take the pin I gave you and stab the earth. I like how I'm not even resisting. My friends are desperately trying to break free and I'm just like, there you go, in full despair. Or I'm meditating. Creating our new supreme empire. <laughs> I, I, what's wrong, Noel? I know it would make you happy or should I, with the last 1% of my battery? Ow! Crush Susie into 8 bits? Leave? Uh oh. Leave Susie alone! You think listening to you makes me happy? No! I'll never be happy, not if I'm controlled by you! Why can't you understand that? Huh? Am I the baddie? Impossible. Noel, perhaps my computations were miscalibrated. Noel, disregard me and, with your own power, choose the world that makes you happy. Battery depleted. Queen? C Queen? Queen, are you okay? Seems she ran out of battery power. Guess we can seal the fountain now, right, everybody? Uh, if we can get out of here. Everybody? Queen. She said, choose the world that makes you happy. I don't want to live in a world ruled by her. But if that wasn't the case, I wonder if this world wouldn't be so bad. Right. She, I guess she doesn't really like her own reality much. And this world would be great if uh, Queen didn't exist. And now that she's run out of battery, that possibility, she can entertain it, right? Huh? Susie, don't you think so too? But you can't just think of it like this, Noel, right? Your father's in hospital even. I, uh... Now that you mention it, Chris, isn't this world just better <laughs> like we can't just up and leave a reality okay we have we have things we need to take care of even if this is a better place we make so many f friends here you know I've never had an adventure like this before the allure of adventure the fantasy of it all I I won't lie it's definitely enticing <laughs> With axes and battles and, and magic? We don't even have to go to school, work on group projects, go home, and whatnot. Where everything can be healed with a little spell. And no matter what happens, no one tells us what to do. Gosh, yeah. So, even if things were really scary just now? I mean, I've never felt more alive. That's... that's... that's the thing, right? Like... Life can be mundane when you fall into a schedule, a routine, going to school, going to work. Whereas here, you know, things are special. And, you know, even though the stakes are high, their lives are on the line. Like Noel said, just heal yourself, you'll be fine. You can make it through anything. Uh, so is there any reason not to? Not that I can think of. <laughs> Me neither. Then, Noel. Let this be my real apology. What are you doing? Concentrating my will into this blade. I will make a new fountain. And unleash a bright future. Uh oh. A future that shines for us. A future whose brightness is born from darkness. Stop! What in the world are you all doing? Well, we thought we would just stop. Just stop. It's time to stop. I mean, stop! Shut the fuck up, Bradley. <laughs> do you realize what will happen if you do that? I... We, we'll just... You'll bring the roaring... 
The roaring? Uh oh, flashback time, story time. When the light is subsumed by shadow. Subsumed? When the fountains fill the sky. Yes. All will fall into chaos. We definitely gotta have that. The titans will take form from the fountains. Titans, where have I seen that word before? And envelop the land in devastation. Uh, yeah. Suddenly this desire isn't so good. The surviving darkness crushed by the darkness will slowly one by one turn into statues leaving the lightners to fend for themselves lost eternally in an endless night uh oh is that your idea of paradise yeah it just seems like a temporary happiness that will eventually result in just utter destruction. Queen is... <laughs> oh damn, I did not know that! Yeah, you want to be a statue queen? You want to become like Birdly? You didn't? But your whole plan was to... I'm just a computer, LaBelle. I don't know everything. I only know what I'm fed. I was just guessing based off the knight's actions. Why the heck, hell, would I want the world to end? Well, that's a relief. Uh, um... I'm sorry, I... I... After everything, I, I just caused trouble for you again, Noelle. I just wanted to help, damn it. That's okay, Birdly, I understand. I thought about it while charging my battery. How the hell did you charge your battery, anyway? Did you just find a place to plug in? You cannot calculate other people's feelings. You... You understand how I feel? No! Idiot, I just said I can't calculate your feelings. Not really, LeBeau. I just don't want no one to be sad. <laughs> well, I'm glad. You two kind of get it now. Guess we all made a pretty sweet team in the end. Yay, friendship. <laughs> What's going on? Uh, Rousey doesn't seem too amused, and neither does Susie. No, we freaking didn't. Question mark. Can you let go of us now? Damn it, your battery's charged again. Oh, yeah. S Susie. Hey, you stood up to Queen. Not half bad. R really? Uh, yeah. Just guess you gotta wake up soon, huh? Uh huh? Everything got so intense I forgot it was a dream. Then, I just hope I get to have more dreams like this. Uh, maybe. Depends. I mean,. We definitely got a lot more chapters coming along. I don't know when they're gonna happen, though. Hey, Noelle, when you wake up, um, well, I just wanted to say, uh, remember this, okay? Well then, I suppose it is time for you all to exit. Running program, tentagoodbye.exe. I will miss each of you. Noelle, your unneeded honesty. Susie, your foolish bravery. Chris, your chill vibes. Uh, b b Berkeley? It doesn't have to be goodbye, Queen. Chris can take you back to our castle town. You and all our recruits can live there. Can she, though? Wouldn't she turn to a statue because that's not her... her dark world? Oh. Cancelled. Deleting tender goodbye dot exe. Alright, time to do what we came here for. Hey, Noelle. If you see the real Susie, just... Yeah. Just know that maybe she's... Maybe she knows what you dreamed about, you know? Maybe there's, like, some sort of osmosis or something that's going on. Yeah. Look, she doesn't have a tail, okay? Promise. <laughs> okay, I got it. It's not a secret. Let's just go, Chris. <laughs> Everyone's laughing. Why? Why are you pushing me? I can walk on my own. There it is. Just us two? Suppose Rousey's not coming with us. Chris? It looks like we're here again, huh? The Roaring Knight? 
whatever they are, they're making these fountains. But is that really a bad thing? Hmm, why? Are they trying to do it in rapid succession? Because they seem to be doing it just one at a time. Since they started showing, everything's gotten a lot more interesting, hasn't it? Well, we don't have to think about that now. Chris, it's your turn. It was as if your very soul was glowing. There it goes again. Go forth, my soul. Do your thing, so I can lock you up at night. I wonder, when it absorbs these fountains, maybe, uh, it gets corrupted somehow. Uh, 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 what? What happened? Oh, it was a dream, wasn't it? Huh? A dream? That was all... A dream? Uh, of course, that, that must have been a dream. You know, I'm not going to question the fact that we both had the same dream. Sitting next to each other, and we both fell asleep. Such feelings, such thoughts. Oh, sweet lady of justice. To think I would ever think Susie would be... Susie? S Susie? Wh what are you doing here? Uh, you invited us to study, remember? Uh, oh, right, I, uh, I... What? Studying with them? Noel, heavens to yikes, they're... They're... Well, I, I guess we could... Try it. Uh, uh, my, my alarm. Uh... I'm going to be late for my shift with Miss Boom. Oh no, how is it that late already? Well, adieu everyone, I must gather my book longings. Ah, uh, how I love the texture of freshly picked up books. <laughs> yes, that's what we all say. Now let us hasten, my dear Noel. Good day, Chris. Susie. Bye, Chris. And, um... Bye, Susie. Um, see ya. <laughs> Stop looking. What? What? Are you looking for something? <laughs> Do nothing. Bye. The heck is her problem anyway? I told her not to look for my tail, damn it. She doesn't listen. Way to treat someone who just saved the world. It was a dream. Remember? Chris! Hey, wait a sec. Chris! We... We just actually saved the world, didn't we? Damn, we really are heroes. And no one even knows. Guess it's better that way, though, right? People would freak out if they knew the world's in danger. Though, kind of sucks Noelle has to forget, too. Did she forget, though? She just thinks it was a dream. Whatever. Let's get out of here. <sighs> well, another dark fountain closed. Jeez, we really are heroes.